guys, it's Ashley, the Sweet Southern Saver, and I'm here to bring you some of the best deals around. And we are at At Home, and I have to say that this Crypt Keeper scared the crap out of me. I was not expecting him to start talking. And yeah, I have a little video of me kind of screaming. I may put that on my YouTube shorts. You guys let me know if you would enjoy that. I was like, ah. Uh, and then they have these cute little ghosts. Looks like a Papa Bear's reading to the little ones, little ghost stories and scaring them. I still can't believe they're adding so much new stuff because I feel like I've covered so much, but they continue to add more stuff and I continue bringing the content to you guys. I like this RIP guy, he kind of moves. This guy's got some really cool green lighting going on. We've got a mini Frank Frankenstein. We have the big one in the back. And we also have this creepy spider. And wow, look at how the red is kind of in their little body. They also have these. I don't know why these look like Jack Skellington to me. Um, but they're not. Uh, they just kind of have his smile, 19. And he is a little Frankenstein pumpkin. They also had these little guys. These were new with their brains hanging out for $14.99. I really like this broom. You say witch like it's a bad thing. I really, really like it though. And I love how they, um, at the bottom, instead of using those bristles, they use burlap. And I really love that because my cats like to eat those bristles. So it's really hard for me to bring um, you know, those uh, cinnamon brooms and stuff like that into my home unless I hang it up because they like to chomp on it and it's not good for them. Um, they also had a couple new potion bottles. I like this one, the wing bat. It's a really tall, beautiful green glass bottle with a little bat on top of it. I really like that. They also have this one, some poison and coffin juice, which is new. And I like that holographic kind of chromey look to it. And this one is really nice too. I like the little hand detail. And you got a nice little skull up there too for $7.99. And this was new. They had um, little wreath hangers. They have a Halloween themed. And then they also have more of like fall theme. I haven't done a fall video yet. You guys let me know in the comments if you're ready for that. I feel like I'm just not ready for it, but I'm ready for Halloween. <laughs> make it make sense. I don't know, but I do like that. I love snow globes and I love these nostalgia trees. They have one I'll show in a minute that is um, white that I really like. Not that it goes with any of my home aesthetic, but it's really cute. We got some more skeleton or skeletons. We have these cute blow mold or not blow molds, but they're like a blown glass with a witch hat on it. It's so cute. I just love the designs that the glass makes. Um, and seeing people do that process is like pretty, um, it's intense. It's very labor uh, intensive. Um, they still have these nostalgia trees that light up. They have this really cool thing, this eyeball that you can look at through, um, through like a little lab scope thingy. They also have this cauldron with the Ouija board on it. I really like the eye in the center. And of course, I had to highlight the kitty cat. They only had like one left, I think. Or maybe they were on the other side. But I was really surprised. But they're really cute. Uh, a real witch lives here with her little monsters. We've seen the owl before. I really like the owl. I was trying not to make a lot of big purchases. But I did go to Cracker Barrel and Home Goods. I don't know if y'all have seen those videos yet. But yeah, I did buy a few things. They also have this. I really love this. It's $4.99. It'd be really cute to put in some bases. Halloween. I'm, I'm loving the, the purple and black for $12.99. Super cute. 
I love when I like walk into the store like this, I completely forget what I already have at home. And I just wanna be like, oh, I love this. This could go here, this could go there. Knowing full well, <laughs> somewhere in the back of my unconscious mind, that I uh, already have a lot. <laughs> Don't hex my vibe, I love that. Spooky, and then I, I, this right here is so nice with the purple nails, <laughs> just <laughs> slay girl, slay. And these little skeleton, skeletons peeking out of a pumpkin is adorable. They're just like, hey y'all. And that's gonna be $34.99. We also have some orange pumpkins. I really like these, but I haven't really invested in any kind of like uh, products like that before. And these little kitty cats are so stinking cute for $5.99. Love, love. Boo, y'all. A haunted home is a happy home. And we've seen him before. He is on my YouTube shorts. If you want to see what he does, it's really cute. And we also have a little black cat. That's new. I love that. I'm a huge cat fan. $5.99. Anything witchy and kitty cats. And also, I'm like getting into ghost. So yeah i like these pumpkins too for 39.99 they kind of have like a vintage look to them for some reason happy halloween for 7.99 and we do have some gnomes those are the only gnomes i've seen um they definitely have toned down pulled back on the gnomes at home goods and everywhere else because for a while it was just bananas like it was just too crazy and this right here is really cool like this is something i would love to diy um any ideas down on how i could do that but i just think it's so cool and i love the little bats on it a few more gnomes this one's cute too i do like the pumpkin on top of it for $19.99 it does light up I am kind of skimming over some stuff if it's something that you are interested in um I also have several um at home videos uh already made Halloween themed probably for the past two weeks so definitely check that out um this is really cool because you can see it lights up inside I'd love to see this on display $69.99 because you can see the actual fibers where the light's gonna come from and I think it's gonna look so cool and I like this one too I like his little hood and we also have enter if you dare here's the ones that I love I really do love these little ghosty nostalgia trees they're so stinking cute i'm like such into like ghosts this year i don't know what happens i'm usually like just like a witch person or a cat person and i like mostly black i have no idea where i would put white but i really like it and i also like this little guy i almost want to get him and like hang him from my um my mirror in my car he's so cute he's just so cute and these little ghosts are adorable. I'm waiting to see if Home Goods puts out the little white ghosts with the little blush cheeks. Those were my favorite from last year. They got some little candy corn ones. You can kind of see it lit up, but it really doesn't do the justice because um, I do justice because of it's so lit up in that home. And they also have the little baby ones, which I love. I do not have a nostalgia tree. Um, but I'm thinking about getting one. They do have the ghost with the little blush, uh, blush on the face. I may think I can get that. I just, I must have completely overlooked it. Uh, it's a really cool wreath. This ghosty is on my YouTube short. He has a really cute, he's like, eh, happy Halloween, like a cute little voice. Bluey, if your kiddo loves Bluey, I could not find a prize to save my life, but he's adorable. And then kind of highlighted some like this right here, uh, cemetery archway, um, which you guys can write down like the H, I think it's H I one, one, 
um, or any number that you like and you can easily go look it up online and get like an animated version of it. Um, just FYI. Oh, and they also have projectors. This one was kind of stuck, but the rest of them, they're mostly just like red stars and spaceships and stuff, which would be great if you're doing like a Stranger Things kind of theme or anything kind of alien based or sci-fi. That'd be really cool. Uh, we definitely have the gargoyle. He's still there for 129. This was really cool. This was the first time I was seeing this. The mummy uh, hand. They're calling it groundbreaker. I thought that was really cool. And I love these right here. Like I just love like anything kind of vintage looking. But I really love and I love the touch of like sparkle on the black. Um, but this one's my favorite. She is just so cute. I like how they just have like the skeletons laying in the back like that. <laughs> it's like a skeleton graveyard. And this guy, I don't know why he's sitting like that. But you guys let me know in the comments. What do you think he's doing? You think he's just a deep thinker? What's going on, Mr. Skeleton? Uh, more statues. I like the peace signs. I'm just kind of doing a quick walkthrough, but I really did like this one. And I think I may have highlighted in one of my other videos. I'm not sure. Now, all this is new to me. The And he was in the glow in the dark things, but he it doesn't say that he glows in the dark. But I really like the detail on Frankenstein. These little guys are glow in the dark. They're $12.99. And then these are really cool. Now, I like this one the best. Is six ninety nine glow in the dark? That'd be really cool. And they also have like some stuff you can like stake into your ground in your yard. I like the skeleton, kind of like he's on the run. You could like throw a little plastic bag or something on him, like he just stole something from your house. Uh, come in, my pretties. I love that for twelve ninety nine. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy this, please hit subscribe and like. And as always, happy shopping, guys.